Are you a nursing student that wants to cut your study time by over 60%? Well, you can head over to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube and sign up for free. Welcome to another edition of Pharmacology in Practice, where we're exploring ruled applications of pharmacology in nursing. Today, we're diving into common side effects associated with certain atypical antipsychotics. We'll be discussing the mechanisms behind the side effect and providing patient scenarios to perfectly illustrate the nursing implications. So what are atypical antipsychotics? Well, there are a class of medications used to treat various psychiatric disorders, including schizophrenia, bipolar disorder, and major depressive disorder. While these drugs have revolutionized the treatment of these conditions, some of them are associated with the significant side effect of weight gain. Now, the atypical antipsychotics that are most commonly tested and linked to weight gain include number one, clozapine, brand name Clozaril. Number two, olanzapine, brand name Zyprexa. And number three, Risperidone, brand name Respiradol. The exact mechanisms behind the weight gain are not fully understood, but it's believed to involve increased appetite, metabolic changes, and alterations in level of hormones like leptin and ghrelin, which regulate hunger and satiety. Fancy words for fullness. Now let's consider the case study of Penny, a 32-year-old patient diagnosed with bipolar disorder. Penny's psychiatrist has prescribed olanzapine, an atypical antipsychotic, to help manage her symptoms. Initially, Penny was experiencing significant improvements in her mood and overall functioning. However, after a few months, she started noticing a gradual increase in her weight, despite no significant changes in her diet or even exercise routine. You as a nurse should encourage her to maintain a balanced diet and engage in regular physical activity to mitigate further weight gain. Additionally, it's crucial to address any body image concerns or even self-esteem issues which may arise due to the weight gain. Also collaborating with a dietitian and referring Penny to a weight management program, which may also be beneficial in helping her maintain a healthy weight. So when working with patients on atypical antipsychotics, nurses should regularly monitor their weight or BMI or body mass index and also waist circumference. It's essential to establish a baseline and track changes over time as early intervention can help prevent significant weight gain. In this episode, we explored the potential for weight gain associated with certain atypical antipsychotics and discussing patient scenarios to illustrate the nursing implications. By understanding this side effect and implementing appropriate monitoring and management strategies, nurses can play a crucial role in promoting overall well-being of patients receiving these medications. So remember, don't be scared, be prepared. Looking to cut your study time in half? Head on over to simplenursing.com forward slash YouTube. You can sign up for free and get access to all of this.